Gregory Itzen, a character actor who played a Nixonian president on 24, died Friday due to complications during an emergency surgery. He was 74. His death was announced on social media by John Kasser, a director and producer on the show. Itzen, who was nominated for a Tony Award for his performance in 1993's The Kentucky Cycle, joined the cast of 24 during the series' fourth season in 2005. Initially a recurring role as Vice President Charles Logan, Itzen returned the following season as president and became one of the show's central figures. He was nominated for an Emmy Award for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Drama Series for his performance. His signature role came in 2005 with with his casting as the Vice President on 24, starring Kiefer Sutherland and, the following season, as the President. He would remain with the series through its conclusion in 2010. After 24, Itzen played the recurring characters on Big Love, The Mentalist, Covert Affairs, Mob City and, most recently, NCIS. On the film side, Itzen appeared as Judge John A. Campbell in Steven Spielberg's Lincoln, 2012, as well as roles in The Change Up, Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas and The Ides of March. Itzen also maintained a busy stage career with many performances at such theaters as the Mark Taper Forum, the Kennedy Center, the Antaeus Theater Company, and the Matrix Theater Company. On Broadway, he was Tony nominated as Best Actor in a Feature Role in a Play for 1993's The Kentucky Cycle. He returned to Broadway in 2010 as Kenneth Lay and Enron. Itzen is survived by wife of 43 years Judy, son Wilkie, daughter Julia and grandson Wilder Gregory.